Hey gang, Muckle Boy here. Welcome back, and thanks for tuning back in. So uh, I've got a really quick PSA here today because this is something that I've been struggling with for the past uh, for the past couple of days, especially with the new patch. Um, there have been problems uh, interface-wise with the with the keyboard, and specifically in the chat area. So I, I was playing around with some of my settings, and I thought I'd share uh, the fix that I had for this. So um, this is what happens when you go to hit the chat button right there. It uh, when the keyboard's docked, it pushes the the chat screen. Up. And that small little bit, you know, that small little animation is enough to uh, consume enough resources to, to lag out your devices in some cases. Um, so what I what you do is, it, you know, it, in order to fix this, what you do is uh, go ahead and hit your keyboard down in the bottom right hand corner. You see the keyboard uh, hide icon. Just press and hold, and you'll see that option right there. And choose undock, and then that'll leave that there. So next time you come in to chat. No animation effect; it just automatically shoots uh, shoots to the top. Now there are a couple of other uh, there are a couple of other options that you can do uh, that you can change to um, uh, you know just to uh, fix up some of the issues there. And one of the first things that, that I had to shut off because it was driving me absolutely bonkers was um, was uh, let's see, let's take a look here. So keyboard. So I'm in settings, general keyboard, uh, turn off auto auto capitalization, auto correction. That's a big one there. Uh, check spelling. Don't even bother because it just doesn't work. Uh, and then you know, as far as the the, the rest of the the options, it's completely up to you. But uh, split keyboard, obviously, leave that there. Predictive, that could work, and in some cases, it does work. In in my case, I just you know. The, the fewer resources the, uh, the 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 operating system has to consume, I think, the better it is. And and I'm talking specifically on iPad 2s. I have a mini iPad 2, and the, the mini iPad 2 ha hasn't had too many options, but my my iPad 2 has been really struggling to keep up with uh, some of the interface changes in the last update. So uh, that's a couple of quick things there to change. If if that helps you. Um, you know, definitely let me know. I mean, th those two things between you know the terrible spell check and uh, the lagging with the animation on resize was was driving me absolutely bonkers. I thought I'd share that today, uh, just that you you know just in case that was happening to a few of you because I know that a few of you are running iPad twos out there too. Uh, you know, for, for the rest of you kids who are who've been kept keeping up with. Uh, uh, Apple's upgrade cycle is probably not a big issue, but yeah, again, just a quick one. Uh, hope you thought that was helpful, and uh, stay tuned for more.